86. And Rashad Saxon is there with them. Baldwin's going to take it in the end zone. It's the backup coming in here tonight. More of a runner from the usual starter, T.J. Bell. And excuse so. me, that was Zach McLeod. Take it up to make a play for you. Sar Benaby, bottom of your screen. And this is going to be a fake hand for Williams to put it in the air for the Tigers. Fairly high kick. Dallas will fair catch it. And a touchdown. Give this to the running back. Coach Rick wants to get those running backs much more involved here tonight. It's Homer again. He'll bounce off a tackle and take it across midfield before Rutledge. T.J. Bell back in at quarterback. And that looked like a near face mask. John Garvin got a fistful of face mask. The Tigers trying to keep it on the ground again. Just could they get a first down here? L little confusion there from Bell, and he's on the run. Just chucks it. Two game going. Bell tries to unload it for Chandler Williams. D.J. Dallas back to receive it. Dallas will let it bounce. It'll roll into the end zone. DJ Dallas. Fake it to him. Now toss it out. And that ball's mishandled. Jeff T Second down. Rozier hands it off again. This is Dallas trying to bounce it outside. DJ Dallas able to pick up. Malik Rozier sets up for his first throw. Rolling to his left. This defense from Savannah State gets. Zach Fiegels. Punting it away for the Hurricanes. Low kick. Does take a Miami bounce. And they'll down it at the 20-yard line. That's a good play. Into this contest, their offensive line, the tight ends, wide receivers, all shaking off injuries. And right now, here's Gibbons. Hands it off right. And Rashad Saxton. Play by Miami's offense, but I think their defense has something to do with that. Gibbons trying to get away. Not going to happen. The field. Chandler Williams punting out of his own end zone. DJ Dallas takes it at the 46. Dallas has got some room if he can cut it upfield. And he as well. He's another talent that we should see this afternoon. Canes will run the football. Brings up second and eight. Travis Homer next to Rozier. Rozier will screen it to him. Homer, a couple jukes. Mark will be third and one here. Tigers crowding the line. They're going to power. That's the first first down for Miami in this game. And now Rozier trying to go to work. Play fake. Tosses it out. Gray has. Hurricanes inside the 10. Hand off to Gray again. Gray keeps the legs moving. The senior. Big number 74. And this one off right side. And again. Second and goal. He's going to be taken down. Nope. Rozier will throw it, and it is caught in the end zone. It's a touchdown. That's an eight. Some boobers here early. Ball taken from the one. Here tonight, and they are ready to flex their muscle. And get upset why you know allow that loss to affect the rest of your season Jalen McLeod up on the right side of that defensive line here he comes T.J. Bell trying to go will come on to kick it away so a switch at punter for Savannah State confident quarterback if you expect to win ball games Rozier to throw again. He's got several teammates open. Dumps it off to DJ Dallas. Dallas can line up anywhere, and he is tough to break. Strength running the football. First down for the Canes. Rozier looking over the middle in Las Vegas. Played 71 plays against LSU last Sunday. First down for Malik Rozier. Rush comes again. Rozier stands in there. Hits this man. It's Brevin Jordan. They have great tight ends, so I'm not surprised at what these young men are doing so far. So second down and 10. Travis Homer, the carry. 
Homer bounces it to the right side. And a nice first down and goal. Nothing tricky from the Hurricanes. Give it to their power back. Second and goal. Gray's the blocking back. Rozier's going to try and sneak it forward. And Malik Rozier looks like he is across the plane. And now two of two. Again. Now get to more of those scores in just a moment. Toss this one over the middle. This is the first positive yardage. Come in with the idea that we're going to compete. And I like that from this ball club. CJ Cracks. Tigers need five. Gibbons. Just throw. They'll tell you, well, you know, I think on the outside, if we can block, our receivers can get open against their defensive backs, or I think our defensive backs can do a pretty good job against. Easy on him right now. Very safe throws and go into the running game. Time and again, DJ Dallas so explosive against LSU. Here's Rozier to throw. Looking downfield, this one a little high, but the catch made and just like gun from the 32 yard line. Rozier fakes the handoff, now tries to step up. He'll go right down the middle. It's caught by Jeff Thomas. A foot race. Stretches out. To nothing. And the three place. And once he got that going, then he's able to get vertical with this big playmaker, Jeff Thomas. Here's Baldwin taking it from his own one yard line. This ball is bobbled. That is a fumble. First snap is a Miami Hurricane. He'll toss it right side. Second down. He'll work out of the gun. Perry goes short. The ball. They need 10 yards here. Perry looks left. Tosses it out. It's caught. And here's Jordan. Once again. That Perry will hand it to him. Tries to stick his nose in there and he'll drive forward. Championship game, so I'm not going to, you know, go too hard on him about that. Try and run this one again. Love to see Perry make a play here. He'll look left. Throw that quick slam. It's right on target. Backs of three of three on extra points. Makes a set to receive this kick. Let it go once more. Four. Tigers have got it. Now they'll try and run it right. Gibbons, good athlete. Trying to get that is when you learn the most. Make a mistake first and simply don't. Wearing green here tonight. Third down and four. Toss it out left. And this is to the speedster. Nice rink tonight. Not letting anybody get near Giovanni Lugo. Lugo gets a boomer away. Wow, he blasted this one. It's inside the five. Perry fakes the handoff. And second down and seven. And this one off. DJ for Nicosi Perry, the redshirt freshman from Ocala. Perry with good protection, able to stand in the pocket. He could take advantage of this opportunity against an outmatched defensive line to show that they can move these guys around. Zach Fiegels has struggled a little bit as the Hurricanes shows you that they are expecting better play from this ball club. Something that you hadn't seen in a while during the golden years. Best offensive play. Rashad Saxon now the running back. Handed to him. Tries to get away B. Another handoff and another tough run for Saxton. Third down 14. Canes pinning their ears back here. T.J. Bell throwing again. Need in motion. Hand it to number six, Saxton. And replay here in the second quarter. Perry tosses this one out. Michael Harley. Chance to make something happen for Miami. To the receiver. Another St. Thomas Aquinas product is Harley. They have produced so many great plays. Touchdown. Trying to do it again. Perry getting out of trouble. And out of... This one's caught. Third catch for Brevin Jordan. And then you've got guys that from that position do well at the next level. Oh, going bricked. 
doing a good job of reeling in some of that top tier talent. Well, not only that, you're in Miami. I mean, there's they don't have to leave Miami to fill their roster with talent. This recruiting class in the state of Florida in 2018 said several publications. What else do you need to do? Second and seven. Dallas takes it from the 10 yard line. DJ Dallas gets down the right side, the 35. Perry hands this off and getting a. Homer again. Five now. Here's Perry. He'll drop back to throw and he wants the home run. Up for grabs and it's caught. Pretty good body of work for Nicosi Perry. His first action is a Miami quarterback. Finding the hot hand right now. Back to the ground game. It's got the hot hand right now. Second and goal from the six yard line. Back to the running attack. Travis Homer trying to really get him. He's considering the opponent. Perry to the air once more. Has a man open. And it. 30. Back to another freshman. Showing an electric foot here tonight. The accountability back on track. He's done just that. Kids leave that institution with a degree. Dropping back, and now Gibbons takes it ahead. Right now, it's Devon Gibbons' show on third and eight. Here comes the rush again. Gibbons has it complete. Nice conversion. Two great programs. Good second effort. Saxton gets loose. Rashad Saxon has a first down. Absolutely nothing right now. They're soaking in every single moment. Every positive play that happens. Just as I say that. So Perry's still in at quarterback. He throws this one away. It's intercepted. Tigers get it. T.J. Bell sticks it right. And the state has not scored a point in 2018. Trying to do it here at Hard Rock Stadium. Kane showing blitz. T.J. Bell now in at quarterback. Bell flushed out of the pocket. On low. He hooked it. That we heard early in the first half. Brought to you by Carhartt, proud sponsor of college football this year. Travis Homer, biggest. Great job with the lead block. Run this one right now, DJ Dallas. The ball. Wants to throw. Now steps up. Tries to get away from trouble. There's the athletic. Is playing very well. You take away that interception. He's done some really good things. Off to the races, DJ Dallas bouncing off tackles. See if they award Dallas, who's done bulk of the work. No, instead, Perry keeps it. He's going to be ganged up on. Now it's Perry looking to his left. He'll loft this one in the air. Going to shut down that Miami run. Perry tosses it over the middle. And it perfect on extra point. Worked out well for him. Congratulations to that couple. Taking it to three now. Miami's starting to really tee off to replace Perry. And getting a surge. Hand off to D'Angelo Durham. Around your quarterback. Third down, Tigers need seven. Going to let Durham have a chance one more time. Jeff Thomas, look out. He has got crazy speed and a whole field to work with. Jeff Thomas. Oh. As a Miami quarterback from the 16 yard line. Weldon over the middle. Three, over 200 pounds. Good looking red shirt. Will keep it himself this time. Get to the outside and cut it in for the touchdown. Hey, that is certainly KC 2.0.
still haven't seen the last one, Jaron Williams. But you've got four able quarterbacks. I think what helps is the new red shirt. We're dueling it out. Jaron Williams waiting in the wings. Rozier still the starter. 26 yard line to start quarter number four. TJ Bell back to throw. Intercepted. Hurricanes trying to set up. Scored a touchdown for the Hurricanes in his last. Hurricanes working that rushing attack. Be 9 0. All Hurricanes here in the second game of the year. Weldon, an easy throw. It's going to hit Brian Pollandy. Lingard looks for the hole, runs right through it. And it's another hurt. Eighth extra point of the night for Baxa. This one will be another touch. They were prepared for everything that LSU threw at them because they had practiced against it and prepared for it. There's still some things they've got to work on, but I think this is an excellent start to getting back. Get tired of hitting one another. Tigers trying to drive it. the importance of continuing to build your program and wanting them to be a part of it. That's something to sell the program. Another possible return here from Jeff Thomas. Jeff Thomas stays on his feet. <laughs> Williams to throw on his first snap, and it's a beauty. Here's Williams again, surveying the field. This one's a little. Run the football. Fourth down at six for Williams. Another throw. Go for the end zone this time, and it's incomplete. And the way Duke looked today against Northwestern. They won't be an easy out. Fully so. Heck, I'm a little concerned as well. Just one ball game in, though. Games at Notre Dame. They've got to come down here to Miami. They've got Florida at home. They've got Clemson at home. They. Oh, that one just blown up. And this is going to be a touchdown. As and straight up and not being low and being able to take on that contact. Weldon, not even on that graphic, but of course, he, again, he is not the Hurricanes legacy. His father playing first, and I see the excitement that it created, not only in this stadium and for their fan base, but around college. Give it to the running back. Another lane open. Canes driving forward. Every Another run. And did a good job keeping that football and getting to the end zone. Oh. Ball club. They're a ball club that contends every year until they play Alabama, of course. Sheldrick Redwine. As we'll take a look at this play and explain more. Tigers of championship football. So, of course, he's used to it. So this is nothing new to him. So I thought what a venue that was, but. I'll tell you what, you know, we, we get a chance to come down. You don't have to change a whole lot with the stadium. Mm -hmm. Now, there is some mystique lost when you don't put it in a football player. <laughs> and not to take anything away from his football <laughs> skill set, because he couldn't just come here if he wasn't a great player. Hurricanes not satisfied with 70 points. They want more, and they are going to get it. It's 76 nothing. If they get this extra point, that will match their all-time. The new Miami kicker puts it in the air. And he boots it in the A man among boys, he and Kennard Lang, those two guys were fierce on the outside. Mm -hmm. Um Alvarez, Kenny Holmes. Really? I still say Kenny Holmes was the toughest guy to block because he was just loaded up on talent here in the Sunshine State. It's a lot tougher to do these days with UCF playing to have coaches that have championship pedigree because they've either Played for one and won one or been on a coaching staff. Durham.
not going to get away. 